Welcome back to Heavy Rain, episode 2. And we are at the mall where I suspect Jason has gone missing. Because we were we were given one job. Look after Jason. Uh, I don't think we did a good job. I'm just going to be honest. Oh, this is where I get to yell Jason 600 times. Jason! Oh, there he is. Fuck out of my way. How do I go faster? Jason! Jason! Oh, so that changes the camera. I can't remember what the button was. Jason! To get my inner monologue. Jason! It's not him. Jason, you really shouldn't want a rough like that, you know? That is him. An awful lot of shit. Please, I didn't even Dad, recognize my I kid. One? I would really love to have one. Please, Sorry Dad, that. come on. Okay, let's go buy a balloon. Great! Hey, champ. What's your name? Jason. Which balloon would you like, Jason? Uh, That's enough you, one. buddy. Here you go. That'll be two dollars, sir. Jason, wait for me. Wait for your dad, son. It's really crowded in here. Come on, come on, come on! There's the red balloon! Of course it's the fucking back pocket. It's always the back pocket last. Are you kidding me? Keep the change. I just told the it kid. It is impossible to try on a pair of shoes with this crowd. Where's Jason? He was here a second ago. I bought him a balloon. I turned around and just disappeared. Disappeared? What do you mean disappeared? Stay here. I'll go get him. I'll be right back. Jason! Oh, God. Jason! Jason! I don't like this. Jason! Get out of my face, wench! Jason! 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 I'm not gonna find him, am I? Jason! Video games. Jason! He's not going to be up at that end one, is he? Toys. Jason! 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 The controller's giving me the heartbeat. Uh, do, 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 do. Jason! Oh, I keep missing that up. Jason! Watch out! Jason! Watch Jason! I don't like playing this part. It's. Jason! It's actually gut wrenching. I've got that. Panic in my in my stomach. I don't know what I'm supposed to do with that. Jason. 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 Jason! 
Great balloon. Jason! Get out of I'm my scared. way! Jason! Jason! a game that has like multiple endings different choices and stuff I just don't feel like anything I would have done would have stopped that oh my gosh that was just like the prologue tell the games that are done in the same style as um, uh, Detroit Become Human. They always have beautiful music and they always have not only beautiful music but they have really good storylines and you can just you get I suppose carried away isn't the right story I guess you get lost in the story of them because Detroit to this day is my favourite game I've ever played and I'm just wondering if um, I'll end up liking this one as much It was originally released in, it was way before um, Detroit Become Human. I happened to play that one first. I think this one was like 2010 on the PS3. And then it came out on the PS4 in like 2016 or something like that. Like a, a, a redone version, which is the one we're playing now. So, I mean, for its age, holding up pretty well. Even when you play Detroit now, it holds up really well. Like, this was back when video games had cutscenes that didn't look like the game. They were slightly different. You know what I mean? Like these cutscenes are like kind of like a more like a video, um, and then it sort of does this cut, and then you play. Whereas the games now, especially like Life is Strange that I'm playing, the scenes that are cutscenes look identical to what you're about to play, and you can just jump into a moment at any time. Like this is a bit different. This is like done really well. Feel bad for this guy. Uh, 
uh, I'll just a mirror. I don't want to open the door. Hey, you gotta literally do every movement. That's cool. If you only knew how much the controller was vibrating, too. You know, writing and directing video games is just as hard as bloody movies now, I tell ya. Because it's not, it's not just, oh yeah, we'll animate this and we'll make that. When you watch the people who play these characters do the motion capture, it's, it's basically a movie. But you've got to account for people's choices, it's got to be immersive, it's, it's got to have so m many extra things. So, judging by the bachelor pad, blames himself or the wife blames him. I don't think the wife would blame him. She didn't come across as that kind. But blames himself. Obviously can't live in the house. Um, I think marriage went south and he's now living on his own in a bachelor pad oh, I can never remember the button to check like my tasks it's definitely not that one but I know there is a button to sort of get my inner monologue oh homework Sean hasn't done his homework yet Let's get him a snack, though. The controls are so crazy. Uh, oh, God. In frame. The trick out of the carton. Grot. I want to get him a snack. Where do I get him a snack from? Clearly not the fridge. Time for a snack. Maybe Sean is hungry. I'll never get used to this R2. Snack, homework, dinner, bed. Oh, how do we get you a snack, buddy? Is this like the pantry? This looks like fucking chemicals. Don't give him that for a snack. I'm sure dryer was on the list. Who what was that noise? Like someone went out. Where'd he go? Oh, he's in the toilet. I don't know how to get you a snack. Maybe I'll talk to you. Oh gosh, are you a deadbeat or something? You don't even have a thing. I'm gonna spend more time looking for a fucking snack. That seemed worth it. Oh. If Sean is hungry, he can find something for himself. What? An asshole. I don't, these controls are pissing me off, I'm not gonna lie. That was worth it. Yeah, okay. I, I'm, I'm a bit hung up on the snacks, I've gotta stop.
Do you want me to get your dinner? No, thanks. I'm not hungry yet. Why do you talk like that? Sean, do you want to do your homework now? Please, Dad. Let me watch TV a little while longer. We'll do it later, okay? I think we should just get right to it. Then it's done and out of the way. Now, get your bag and get set up in the kitchen. I'll help you. Turn this shit off. Apparently you can get your own snack though. Thanks buddy. Hey, hey. Oh fuck these controls, seriously. There is going to come a moment where I need to be able to fluently move and it's not going to happen. Now, how long am I supposed to sit here and watch him do homework? This seems like such a little amount of time. Remember when we had a nice house and you had a brother? Ends was the days. Greece has Sean this weekend. Seems like he can't wait to get back to his mother. I don't know what else to do. I can't cook your dinner till your homework's done. I'm finished. Can I go watch TV? Mm. Come here, let me have a look. Hey, pretty good. Looks like you're done. <laughs> Off you go. If that was a mess, I'd just ran my finger over it pretending I knew what I was talking about. Look how awkward he is around his own child. It's kind of weird. It's kind of sad. What are you throwing it on your bag for? On your back? Night. No, I don't want to say good night. He hasn't even eaten dinner yet. How do we cook dinner? Snack, homework, dinner, bed. Oh, what's the time? Keeps showing me fucking clocks. 6.30. Dinner's at 7. He's getting his own snack, look at him. Why couldn't I just reach in there? Just shoves me out the way too. Pretty self-sufficient kid. He's having his snack. Maybe I can prep some dinner. What's in here? Seems dangerous to keep the beans next to the paint. We're lighting this place up like fucking Luna Park. You alright? Let's look at these bills. Ethan Myers. Confidential and personal, it seems. Is it Ethan Myers? What's his last name? 
When the parents came home from church, Bless all you. their children were gone. They searched and called for them. They cried and begged. But it was all to no avail. The children had never been seen again. Why would you send him there? Can't say bless you. It's dinner time. I'd better make something for Sean. Do you want me to get your dinner? Oh yeah, I'm really hungry. Okay, I'll go see what I can find. I'll call you when it's ready. We have him pizza, motherfucker. Yeah, fuck roast chicken. Pizza every time, man. He's just a little kid. Little kids love pizza. In the micro, were they? Bless you, he's getting sick. He's getting sick. That's not long enough. That is some sort of mystical microwave. Oh, you're full of shit, mate. Oh, God. You can One slice. Now, Sean. Your meal is ready. I'm meal? Coming. He's clutching his straws here, buddy. Meal. More on the uh, bench there if you want it. Not sure one little slice is enough for you, buddy. If I could have a slice with you. Oh, juggling. Ooh. Still got it. Still yeah, got it. I didn't know you could juggle. I haven't tried it in a long time. <laughs> Do you think you could teach me too? Sure. I'll show you if you like. I gotta remember the age of the games a little bit. You know. But like anyway, sure, I will show you if you like. Let me sit down with my boy. His dinner, son. God, that'd be hard. One critical moment, just everything snatched. Oh my gosh, my hand green. Kind of went green there. Look, wow. Simple things amuse simple people. <laughs> I'm always looking for levity in a um, serious situation. <laughs> can't help it one piece one piece of pizza come on man all right you have to go to bed soon brother just leave your snacks on the uh, couch there at least you took your shoes off good man maybe I should wash the dishes real quick did we do? Let's see what he's watching. They're in the outback. That's for sure a didgeridoo. <laughs> Makes me feel a little bit uncomfortable. How are things at school? Is your teacher nice? Everything's fine, Dad. Maybe I can chat with you while I sit down. It's a little bit more natural. Oh, come on, I gotta stand up to talk to you? Um. 
So, do you want to talk a little? Talk about what? I don't know, about you, your friends. How things are going. Nothing special. Fine. Do you want to play something? What do you say we play together for a while? I'd rather watch TV. Uh, well, it's almost 8.30, so let me just go and see what time you're supposed to go to bed. 8 o'clock, fuck. I blew it. Get your ass to bed, kid. Come on, Sean. It's time for bed. I'm not tired yet. Can I stay up a little longer? I'm not tired yet. Can I stay up a little longer? All right, we'll wait a little before going to bed. But... Don't say anything to your mother, okay? Our oh, Morty fucking light. Jesus. Hey, right, what's this? This is creepy. Come on, Sean. It's time for bed. I'm not tired yet. Can I stay up a little longer? No. Now that's not very reasonable, is it? You have school tomorrow. You have to get some sleep. All right, I'm going. Are you coming with me? Go brush your teeth and put on your pajamas. I'll come up. I can't put my finger on what their accents are. Are they weird? Ah, oh, little fiddly. Don't, don't be touching my pizza there. Put it back in the fridge, you savage. No, you just didn't leave it out. Well, just make sure your fucking doors are locked. Probably something you should do. <gasps> Wait. Let's go outside. Fuck this. Just need to get a breath of fresh air. At least I can afford a two-story apartment. It's kind of nice. I thought there was some dude hanging from there. Wasn't letting me go in, in the liquor cabinet. This holding down R2 just to walk is the craziest thing ever. Right, I'm going to go ahead and switch that on for a sec. to see what's out there. Good night, Sean. My teddy! I haven't got my teddy, Dad! You must have left it somewhere in the house. His lips aren't you fucking moving. You're a hell of a ventriloquist, Dad, kid. Please, I can't sleep without him. <gasps> I'll go and get him. I know where he is. I know where he is. I know where he is. You see that kid? He's got a fucking bright future ahead of him. Can't sleep without my daddy, without my teddy. And he was just looking at me. He was telling me with his mind. Fucking crazy. Yeah, he's your teddy, buddy. It's so lucky I came in here before and found it on accident. Otherwise, you all would have been privy to another 25 minutes of this video of me searching every drawer, everything this fucking house would allow me to search to find that thing that was just sitting there on top of the washing machine dryer, whatever the fuck it is here. Thanks, Dad. Feel free to move your lips, son, when you talk to me. Good night, Sean. Night. Dad? Mm, that's freaking yep. me out. Why do you look so sad? I think I just need some time. To get back to the way things were. You know, Dad, what happened to Jason wasn't your fault. Thank you for telling me with your Thank mind, you. son. <laughs> means a lot. Son. Maybe if you're a bit warmer, 
You'll learn to move your lips. Sleeping also involves closing your eyes, boy. You're freaking me out. I'm going to go ahead and switch these lights off too. Like, fuck, I'm closing that door. Psychotic episode, I'd say. Massive amounts of grief. Where the hell are you all of a sudden? Wow, in the middle of the street, he just blanked out and all of a sudden, in the street he is. An origami little animal? Wow, okay. Really odd. Can't be corner north. We're gonna have to remember that. I won't, but we're gonna have to. Can't be corner north. I'll forget about next episode. I'm gonna go ahead and pause because I'm gonna go back to that in the next episode to see um, that new character that we no doubt play with. I think it's about four different characters we play with. Um, which were, it was three on Detroit, but um, I think it's four on this one. So far, I'm really liking the game. I know it's very monotonous, some of it, but I'm really, really enjoying it, really enjoying it. Um, if you are as well, please leave a like, um, subscribe to the channel, and also let me know in the comments below. You can follow me on Twitch, twitch.tv forward slash the no good game, where I... Um, stream Thursdays, Saturdays and Sundays. We do community games on Sundays, horror games Thursdays, and we also do um, a lot more on Saturdays. It's a bit of a mixture. You can also follow me on Instagram at The No Good Game. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you on the next one.